What's up, buddies and gentlemen? Welcome back. Today's video is brought to you guys by Matricom. Now, with that said, we're actually taking a look at the G-Box Q3 along with the Logitech keyboard. It's actually a bundle right now, and you can actually check that out on their site as well. So, what exactly is the G-Box Q3? So, basically, it's Android built directly into a set-top box. It features Android Nougat 7.1 and high, has a high-speed processor, so you can actually game on this. You can actually be pretty productive with the keyboard that it comes with, and you can, of course, stream TV shows directly to your TV or maybe even a monitor if you're feeling that. Now, the processor built into this is a quad-core S905X CPU paired with a powerful Mali 450 graphics processor. So, of course, processing-wise, you are perfectly set to go in case you're streaming or maybe gaming. Now, of course, if you're playing a really really hardcore game on this maybe it's gonna lag here and there but aside from that i found that android is overall very smooth and the fact that it features 7.1 makes it even more smooth overall now it also comes with all the ports that you need for example an sd card slot usb 2.0 hdmi ethernet a power jack and of course optical audio it also has an aux input as well now this of course is specially geared towards everyone who don't have a smart TV but always wish that they did and just don't feel like dropping 2000 on a brand new smart TV. All you do is plug it into the HDMI port. In this case, I'm actually going to be showing you guys a miniature version of a TV, which in this case is a projector, but we're going to set up our tiny little home theater right here and we're going to have a tiny little projector set onto a pretend wall. And then of course, I'm going to show you guys the power of the G-Box along with a gaming controller and the keyboard all in one go. So it's basically a home theater built onto a table now with that said guys as you can see the overall ui is very very nice it matches you know what other smart tvs would typically look like with a home videos music apps games live tv and of course different themes to choose from it's fairly simplistic and of course you get the full power of google play so you can install every single application you would typically have on your phone directly built onto this you can actually stream very fast and the overall wi-fi connection built directly into this is also very very quick as well one of the problems that i have with a lot of other streaming boxes or set top boxes is that they have a bunch of bloatware built directly onto them and this results in slow wi-fi slow streaming slow android overall but that's not the case with this one you get what you pay for and it is very very optimized mostly for your entertainment is that to say that you can't play games on this or maybe even have a skype conversation with people no you can go ahead and do that as well this comes in at around 99 dollars and but with that said this of course has the bundle so go ahead and check out that as well i'm going to quickly tell you guys about this cool little logitech keyboard this of course is a very famous keyboard when it comes to people interacting with their tv mostly because it's not only a keyboard but it also has a touchpad built onto it the keys are very very smooth it's very low key and the signal is amazing you can actually go into maybe like another room and still continue typing directly onto this but my favorite part is the fact that it's beyond ridiculously durable if you hand this to a kid and they accidentally drop it or chuck it the keyboard's going to be fine the set top box i don't really know about now with that said guys check this out below the link is there and of course the cyber monday deals are going away so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if so leave a like and don't forget to subscribe in my experience everything is super quick uh the streaming is a great playing games on this can be a little iffy but if it's a typical game like clash of clans or maybe even a racing game it'll be perfectly fine it's very very small has all the ports that you definitely need and overall i give it a solid 9 out of 10 thank you guys for watching this is going to be me logging off.